Chapter 1068 Wu Dong Qian Kun The enormous mountain peak was just like a giant hammer. With an extremely shocking effect, it ruthlessly smashed onto Xu Zong's enormous body. A miserable tiger roar reverberated across the sky. Everyone was undoubtedly a little stunned when they saw this scene. When they recovered a moment later, they still felt some disbelief. Who could have imagined that Xu Zhang, who had just gained the upper hand, would actually end up in such a state in the blink of an eye? How can this be? Chen Tong and the rest muttered in a petrified manner. A moment later, their eyes suddenly looked towards the enormous light array in the sky. That light pillar had enveloped Xu Zhang. Every time majestic Yuan power surged out from the surface of Xu Zhang's body, it would be disintegrated by that light pillar. Is it that formation that has greatly reduced Xu Zhang's fighting strength? Everyone's eyes flashed. Only then did they come to a sudden understanding. Soon after, they were secretly startled. Just what was this light array? It was actually so powerful. Not only was it able to disintegrate the unusually powerful Dark Abyss armor on the surface of Xu Zong's body, it was even able to disintegrate and digest the Yuan power within the latter's body. What a terrifying fellow. Although they were relatively unfamiliar with that light array, it did not stop them from feeling shocked by Lin Dong's eye-popping actions. Bang! The mountain peak in Lin Dong's hand was finally unable to endure the enormous force and finally exploded. Below, Xu Zong's entire body was covered in fresh blood. Numerous bloody scars appeared on his body and even his white bones were exposed. Lin Dong randomly tossed aside the remaining large rock in his hand. His mouth gently panted a couple of times as he glanced at the exceptionally miserable Xu Zhang, who was covered in fresh blood. It was not that the latter did not want to retaliate. However, the Yuan power within his body had been suppressed by the ancient universe formation. In other words, Lin Dong had turned him into an ordinary powerless giant beast for a short period of time. This kind of suppression was something that Lin Dong was only able to activate the ancient universe formation after he advanced to the profound death stage. In the past, the ancient universe formation was only able to disintegrate some of the energy. It was impossible for it to completely suppress a peak perfect profound death stage expert. This kind of ability could be considered quite abnormal. After all, one only needed to think about how a powerful opponent could only barely use the Yuan power within their body for a period of time. One could tell just how terrifying it was. Although this period of time was extremely short, most of the time, it was enough to determine the victor of a battle. Of course, this ability might be powerful, but one would not be able to activate it unless one was locked onto by it. Xu Zhang had been careless earlier and was unable to figure out the use of this formation. Hence, he was trapped by it. Immediately, he turned from a lively tiger to a stupid beast that could only take a beating. Lin Dong was clearly adept at beating a drowning dog. Therefore, he took advantage of this opening and gave the originally majestic-looking Xu Zhang a beating until he was incomparably miserable. The huge formation in the sky began to tremble. The light pillar that enveloped Xu Zhang also began to turn illusory. Although this ancient universe formation was quite powerful, it was not an easy task to completely suppress a peak perfect profound death stage expert. Can't suppress it anymore? When Lin Dong saw this scene, he smiled faintly. Soon after, he walked towards the giant dark gray tiger. The latter's scarlet tiger eyes were filled with hatred and a trace of fear. I can only cripple you first. Lin Dong's footsteps paused in front of Xu Zhang. He clenched his hand and the lightning emperor scepter appeared in a flash. Lightning crazily surged on it. Soon after, a stern expression flashed across his eyes. Without any hesitation, the Lightning Emperor's scepter in his hand ruthlessly pierced into Xu Zong's huge body. Roar! A miserable screech immediately sounded. Many lightning bolts frantically flickered on Xu Zong's body. His huge body also began to shrink at a shocking speed. A moment later, he returned to human form. The Lightning Emperor's scepter had pierced through his shoulder causing fresh blood to flow. Lin Dong clenched his hand and withdrew the Lightning Emperor Scepter. The Scepter was ruthlessly swung against Xu Zong's body. The enormous force directly sent the latter flying a thousand feet away. You have lost. Lin Dong indifferently looked at the deathly pale Xu Zhang in front of him. The latter's aura was already quite weak. Clearly, Lin Dong had given him a serious injury earlier. He no longer had the strength to truly fight. 
the victor of this battle had already been decided. All the eyes in the sky gathered over. Soon after, a buzzing sound quickly appeared. No one could have imagined that this battle would actually end in such a dramatic manner. Meng Shan and General Tianyi's faces were deathly pale. This was especially the case for General Tianyi. His entire body was covered in cold sweat when he thought about how he had actually tried to capture Lin Dong back then. Fortunately, Lin Dong did not attack back then. Otherwise, it was likely that he would not have the opportunity to escape. Xu Zhang spat out the blood in his mouth in front of the many pairs of eyes. His eyes were vicious as he stared at Lin Dong and laughed coldly. You have quite a few tricks up your sleeves. Do you think that you are a match for this king in a real fight? In a life and death battle, any trick is also considered strength. You are after all a demon commander. There is no need for you to utter such laughable words, right? Lin Dong's eyes were strange as he glanced at Xu Zhang and said. Xu Zhang was stunned. However, the viciousness in his eyes did not diminish. It is time to determine the victor of the battle over there. Lin Dong ignored Xu Zhang. He lifted his head and looked at the distant sky. Monstrous bloodlight permeated the place as a tiger roar resounded across the sky. After which, bloodlight spluttered and a black figure shot backwards. Finally, it rubbed against the ground, leaving a 10,000 feet deep scar. Bang! A blood red light figure descended from the sky. At this moment, Lil Flame was also in his half human half beast combat form. His body was also covered with many bloody scars. Fresh blood flowed down, causing his originally ferocious face to become even more terrifying. Clearly, he had also experienced a relatively intense battle earlier. He took a large step forward and grabbed the similarly weak shadow guard. After which, he tossed him towards Xu Zhang with a sinister expression. Do you still remember what I said to you when you snatched half of my essence blood inheritance back then? I said that it is mine and you will return it to me sooner or later. Xu Zhang looked at the shadow guard, who had been tossed to his side. His eyes were dark and stern as he wiped off the trace of blood from the corner of his mouth. Little Flame had indeed said this back then. However, would Xu Zhang, who had just reached the profound life stage, take him seriously? At that time, Little Flame was perhaps just an ant in his eyes. An ant's provocation was something that he would basically ignore. However, who would have imagined that this ant of the past would actually be able to overturn him today? Hand over the essence blood inheritance. Lin Dong looked at Xu Zhang and softly said. Xu Zhang wiped off the trace of blood on his face. His eyes were dark as he stared at the Lin Dong duo. Soon after, he stood up and grabbed the shadow guard beside him. He lifted his head and looked at the countless pairs of eyes in the area. He never imagined that there would come a day when he, one of the eight great demon commanders, would end up in such a miserable state. Ha ha, I am a great demon commander. It will be far too embarrassing if I am defeated by the both of you. Xu Zong's voice was a little hoarse as he muttered. Are you still planning to struggle even now? Little Flame laughed coldly. Xu Zhang turned his head to look at Lin Dong and Little Flame. He suddenly laughed. Are the both of you curious about this shadow guard? Lin Dong frowned slightly. Let me show you his true appearance. Xu Zhang parted his mouth into a smile. His smile was a little distorted. Soon after, he tore apart the black robe that covered the shadow guard. Soon after, a somewhat familiar face appeared in front of everyone's eyes. Is that Xu Zhang? The entire place was silent. Soon after, shocked exclamations erupted. This was because the appearance of the shadow guard was exactly the same as Xu Zhang. However, the latter's eyes were relatively empty. Was that a puppet? This is my twin brother. However, I snatched away his life force when he was born. Hence, he was extremely weak when he was born. As he gradually grew up, he eventually died due to his weakness. Xu Zong's hand touched the shadow guard's face. His smile caused one to feel a chill from deep within their bones. After he died, I used a secret technique to refine him into a ghost fetus that shared my life with me. Although this secret technique is vicious, it has one benefit. In the future, I will be able to completely transform the energy of the ghost fetus into my own. Ha ha, this shadow guard is actually a human cauldron that I have raised. He was raised using my biological brother. The entire place was silent. The expressions of many changed slightly when they heard these words. Xu Zong's heart was truly vicious. It was really unexpected. 
Now, it is time for this brother of mine to repay me. Chu Zhang parted his mouth into a smile. Many bloodlines suddenly spread from under his feet. They were just like a blood formation that completely covered him in the shadow guard. His hand was like a blade that was inserted into the shadow guard's chest. Fresh blood flowed out and the shadow guard's body rapidly withered. Chu Zong's aura swelled at an extremely frightening speed. It had actually reached the limit of the samsara stage. A frightening airwave crazily spread, preventing anyone from approaching. This bastard. Little Flame's expression was shocked and furious as he watched this scene. Clearly, he did not expect such an unforeseen event to occur. Chu Zhang is actually going to attack the samsara stage? Many exclamations sounded in the sky. They could feel an aura that caused one to be unable to breathe swiftly gathering and taking shape. Big brother, what should we do? Little Flame looked towards Lin Dong and asked in a deep voice. Lin Dong's expression was indifferent as he looked at the devil-like Xu Zhang, who was laughing wildly at the sky. A thick, almost substance-like murderous desire flashed across his eyes. Soon after, he slowly lifted his hand in front of the many pairs of eyes. Two of his fingers were curled. One of his fingers was pitch black while the other was resplendent silver. There seemed to be a lightning glow overflowing from it. This is not how I allowed you to use your brother. Fresh blood continuously dripped down from between Lin Dong's fingers, while his complexion turned pale at an alarming rate. Meanwhile, there seemed to be two ancient tiny symbols faintly appearing on his fingertips. Therefore, you should go and die. After Lin Dong's soft voice sounded, a ray of fresh blood suddenly shot out from between his fingers. Black light and lightning intertwined within the fresh blood. The two types of energy were like yin and yang, perfectly fusing together. Puff. The blood light ray shot out in a straight line. The frightening energy field around Xu Zong's body was easily shattered. Blood light flashed and the light ray directly penetrated the spot between Xu Zong's brows. The ferocious and wild laughter on Xu Zong's face suddenly stiffened at this moment. Chapter 1069 Wu Dong Qian Kun A thin blood-colored ray of light shot across the sky, after which, it seemed to tear through space itself as it disappeared in a flash. However, everyone's eyes were currently focused on Xu Zong's gradually stiffening face. From the latter's scarlet eyes, they could see the rapidly disappearing life force in the remaining fear. How is this possible? Fresh blood flowed down from between Xu Zong's brows. The world in front of him began to darken. His shaky vision was able to see the young man in the distance, who had lifted his hand. Even at this moment, he was unable to believe that Lin Dong had actually torn apart the energy field he used to attack the samsara stage and forcefully unleashed a fatal blow. The energy field from before was something that even a peak perfect profound death stage expert would not be able to penetrate. However, it was easily shattered by Lin Dong's attack. What kind of attack was that? That fellow actually still had some tricks up his sleeves? Xu Zong's vision rapidly darkened, after which, his body swayed. Finally, he fell to the ground in front of many pairs of shocked eyes. I really cannot accept this. As the final words echoed in his heart, Xu Zong's consciousness completely darkened. A demon commander of a generation had fallen. The entire deep lightning mountain had become completely silent at this moment. A gust of wind blew over. However, it was unable to disperse the tense atmosphere on this messy mountain. Chu Zhang had fallen. Many pairs of eyes looked at the figure that had fallen. Their pupils seemed to have widened at this moment. The demon commander of deep lightning mountain had been finished off by that human called Lin Dong? How can this be? Some people muttered. That was one of the eight great demon commanders of the Beast War region. Although Xu Zong's strength was not outstanding amongst the eight great demon commanders, he was still an overlord demon commander. In fact, there were only a handful of people in the Beast War region who could defeat him. Therefore, they could imagine just how terrifying the commotion it would cause in the Beast War region if news of this spread. The entire mountain was completely silent as Lin Dong slowly lowered his hand. Fresh blood continued to drip from his fingertips, while his face appeared exceptionally pale. The previous attack had merged the strength of two ancestral symbols within his body as well as his vast amount of essence blood. Hence, the exhaustion was extremely frightening. However, Lin Dong had no other choice. 
Although he was aware that Xu Zhang had less than a 30% chance of advancing to the samsara stage, he did not dare to take the risk. Once Xu Zhang successfully advanced, the situation today would likely be completely different. Although the Lin Dong duo would not be killed, it would clearly be difficult for them to achieve their objective. Big brother, are you alright? Upon seeing Lin Dong's expression, Little Flame was startled as he hurriedly asked. Lin Dong shook his head. He was just about to speak when his expression suddenly turned cold. He suddenly lifted his head and saw a light figure rushing over from afar. That figure extended his hand and was about to grab Xu Zong's corpse. You're courting death. Lin Dong cried out coldly. He curled two of his fingers and pressed forward. That light figure had clearly seen Lin Dong's extremely terrifying finger earlier. Hence, it was startled upon seeing this. Its body, which was rushing forward, actually paused for a moment. It was precisely this pause that allowed Little Flame to react. With a furious roar, it charged forward explosively. Ferocious fist winds ruthlessly smashed towards that light figure. Bang! Wild and violent wind swept apart and Little Flame hurriedly took a couple of steps back. That light figure was also revealed. It was Qin Shi. Humph! Lin Dong's eyes were ice cold. A thought passed through his mind and the sky-devouring corpse immediately hurried over. It appeared in front of Qin Shi and blocked him. Are you still planning to take revenge for Xu Zhang? Lin Dong stared at Qin Shi in a dark and solemn manner as he slowly asked. Qin Shi immediately laughed dryly upon hearing this. His eyes were filled with fear when he looked at Lin Dong. Xu Zhang's death was also a great shock to him. Moreover, his strength was similar to Xu Zhang's. In this case, it was obvious that Lin Dong also possessed the ability to kill him. Moreover, there was also a sky-devouring corpse that gave him a great headache. He did not have much of a relationship with Xu Zhang to begin with. The reason why he had intervened this time around was because the latter had given him extremely generous conditions. However, Xu Zhang had already died and there was no longer any meaning to such a deal. There was no longer a need for him to make an enemy out of this troublesome Lin Dong. What is young brother Lin Dong saying? I do not have a deep relationship with Xu Zhang and there is no need for me to take revenge for him. Qin Shi smiled. He glanced at Xu Zhang's corpse as his eyes flickered. I only wish to make a deal with young brother Lin Dong. Why don't you give me Xu Zhang's corpse? Lin Dong's eyes narrowed slightly as he stared at Qin Shi. The latter was also smiling as he faced him. His face was filled with cunningness. I'm sorry, I'm afraid that I cannot agree to this request. Lin Dong smiled faintly. There was the other half of the essence blood inheritance within Xu Zong's body and Little Flame needed it. Although the other half of the essence blood inheritance had already been refined by Xu Zhang, Lin Dong still had the means to force it out. Qin Shi's expression changed slightly upon hearing this. He laughed dryly, young brother Lin Dong, will you not reconsider? It is always good to befriend another friend in this beast war region. Could it be that brother Qin Shi does not wish to befriend me? Lin Dong asked with a half smile. The corner of Qin Shi's mouth twitched. He glanced at the sky devouring corpse, which was less than ten steps away from him. After which, he looked at Little Flame, who was cautiously staring at him. Finally, his body slowly relaxed as he spoke in a somewhat hoarse voice. How can that be? This king is also extremely happy to be able to befriend brother Lin Dong after a fight. Lin Dong smiled. He waved his sleeve and the burning sky cauldron rushed out. It directly sucked Xu Zong's corpse into it. Qin Shi finally sighed quietly upon seeing this. A disappointed expression flashed across his eyes. This expression was noticed by Lin Dong. Immediately, he felt a little strange in his heart. Could it be that Qin Shi was also aware of the other half of the essence blood inheritance within Xu Zong's body? However, he was from the Lion tribe. Even if he obtained this essence blood inheritance, he would not be able to perfectly absorb it. After Xu Zong's corpse disappeared, the originally tense atmosphere on Deep Lightning Mountain also stealthily disappeared. Chen Tong's group exchanged glances with each other upon seeing this. Soon after, they suddenly knelt down with one knee on the ground. Some of the Deep Lightning Mountain guards behind them hesitated. However, they eventually knelt down in a somewhat lost manner. Chen Tong's five generals clearly possessed great rallying power in Deep Lightning Mountain. General Yan, please take the title of commander. 
a low and deep cry spread over Deep Lightning Mountain. Those Deep Lightning Mountain guards also followed suit and cried out. In an instant, thunder-like cries reverberated across the sky. Even more people from Deep Lightning Mountain watched this scene in a somewhat panicked manner. Was Deep Lightning Mountain about to change hands? Meng Shan and General Tian Yi were also a little panicked. However, Xu Zong's death had caused them to lose all confidence. At this moment, they did not dare to voice out to stop them. Rumble. It was also at this moment that a rumbling sound suddenly appeared from below Deep Lightning Mountain. After which, everyone saw a steel-like black torrent sweeping over while accompanied by an earth-shaking ferocious aura. It was the Tiger Devouring Army. General Yan, please take the title of commander. The Tiger Devouring Army suddenly paused when they were still some distance from the mountain peak. After which, they knelt down with one knee and an orderly low roar was emitted like a tiger's roar. Rumble. As the aura of the Tiger Devouring Army swept over, some of the lingering Deep Lightning Mountain experts finally clenched their teeth. After which, a black mass of figures all over the mountain knelt down. General Yan, please take the title of commander. In the sky, the leaders of the factions within the territory of Deep Lightning Mountain also understood the current situation when they saw this scene. Xu Zhang had died, and the only one in Deep Lightning Mountain who had the prestige to become the demon commander was Little Flame. Since there was no way to change this outcome, it was best to quickly build a good relationship with this demon commander they trusted. Otherwise, they might have to suffer in the future. A smile surfaced on Lin Dong's pale face as he watched this spectacular scene. He was a human. Regardless of how strong he was, it was extremely difficult for the people of Deep Lightning Mountain to accept him as the new demon commander. Moreover, he did not like it. Hence, it would naturally be the best outcome if this position could be controlled by Little Flame. Hence, he looked towards Little Flame and nodded slightly. Little Flame hesitated for a moment upon seeing this before agreeing. Deep Lightning Mountain was a relatively good faction. If they could gain control of it, it would be quite beneficial for them. If they were to charge back to the Eastern Zon region in the future, it might be a relatively powerful trump card in their hands. Little Flame's body moved in front of everyone's eyes. He rushed into the air and swept his tiger eyes across the entire place. Finally, he looked towards Meng Shan and General Tian Yi and asked in a deep voice, Do the both of you submit? The expressions of the Meng Shan duo changed slightly upon hearing this. They hesitated for a long time in front of the countless piercing gazes around them. Finally, they knelt down with one knee. At this moment, they had lost all courage to resist. Little Flame nodded upon seeing this. Subsequently, his eyes looked towards Huo Miao, who was the only one left standing. He said, If you are unwilling to remain in Deep Lightning Mountain, you can leave. Humph, how majestic. Huo Miao stared at the stocky-looking little flame and snorted softly. Her face gradually turned red as she knelt down with one knee. She no longer had the arrogance she had in the past. Moreover, the thing that shocked Chen Tong and the rest the most was that this lady was not this obedient even when Xu Zhang recruited her as a general back then. At this moment, everyone in Deep Lightning Mountain had completely lost all resistance. Little flame stood in the sky. His tiger eyes swept across the place. Finally, he waved his large hand in a dignified manner. His low and deep cry reverberated across Deep Lightning Mountain. Everything in Deep Lightning Mountain will remain the same. Everything will remain the same, except for the position of Demon Commander. Congratulations Commander Yan. Countless people lowered their heads. Orderly cries that contained respect and respect reverberated across the sky in a mighty manner. Deep Lightning Mountain had finally changed owners amidst this mighty roar to be continued.